Y'all might be wondering what's in this beautiful box. Thank God, bro. I was like, wait, did I actually forget a sticker? I'm like, I'm pretty sure I didn't. <laughs> Imagine I just have my, like, address right there. Like, there's no, like, outtakes or blurring. Like, let me fix that, dude. Like, y'all probably wondering what's inside of this box. So, what's in this box is... A lot of stuff to go ahead and build a keyboard. Uh, luckily... Glorious actually sent us out a bunch of stuff. So we're gonna be putting together a keyboard today um, I'm pretty excited. I basically decided to go with a bunch of crazy colors because I figured I, I really loved this keycap set, but unfortunately I was like I wish the color went over more So I was like, you know what? Why don't we compensate the color with other things like I don't know um, a red USB uh, cable maybe even a um, yellow nice little yellow knob or even a blue top plate. And I said, screw it. Let's mix up all the colors. All right, there we go. Okay, bam. So for anyone who doesn't know, this is being filmed live on Twitch right now. So say hi, Twitch, chat, anyone? Hi, hi, YouTube. All right, so let me go over with you. So basically right here, we have their GMMK Pro. Uh, this is basically their bare bones. So basically what that means, it's a fully put together uh, keyboard. Oh, so actually wait, right here, it says on the back. So we got gasket mounted design, CNC aluminum body, pre-lubed uh, stabilizers, GOAT stabilizers, they're screw-ins, um, hot swappable uh, switches. So you can put in, you know, whatever it is. I think it's a five, it takes up to a five pin switch. I think I think that's right. I think that's how you say that but this is basically their premium keyboard so I'm actually really excited to build into it I have not had a board like this um the last GMK board I'll actually show you guys so this is the last keyboard of theirs that I had which is like <laughs> it's so old it actually has their old like I don't know URL on it it actually says the uh PC gaming race so it still leads to glorious but that's not their actual like URL anymore to answer your question, no, there's no soldering involved in this. I don't have to worry about soldering or anything like that. Basically, what we're gonna do is we have our pre-lubed switches, which are hot swappable. Um, so these are pre-lubed links. I've actually used these before. I have these in another build of mine, and they're amazing. They are a linear switch, super smooth, great sound. Um, I can't wait to hear what it sounds like in this. And then you guys already saw this, but the Celestial Fire keycap set. Um, which I think is cool because I like all the different colors. I wish it would have extended more, but that's why we just added in our own color. So we have our yellow knob, which is rotary knob, which goes on the top over here. So I think that can do like media control and things like that, volume and stuff. Probably just can use it for media control. Um, red little cable. So I figured, you know, red's one of my favorite accent colors in case you guys haven't been able to tell that yet, but one of my favorites. And then we have the top frame, which just snaps right on. And Oh, look at that. I love the branding on this, by the way, like the black on black. So sick. Oh, okay, fancy. Okay, fancy, I see you. Oh, for the knob. Sick. All right, and then we have our glorious little sticker. And then we have the non-edible candy that they put in here. Rude. Can't believe they don't let you eat the candy. So this is the board we went with black. Um, what do we got here? So we have, I think, extra screws. What is this for? Oh, optional extra gasket strips. Oh, it's kind of sick. So basically they include these like little extra like foam in case you're like, oh, well it's not like sitting properly and it's not mounted properly. So you actually have these extra foam pieces in case you need to go in there and adjust it. That's kind of sick. Standard comes with a braided cable, which I think is kind of sick. I think every company should do that. Surprisingly, every company does not. So get your stuff together. This is the keycap puller. And then we have our switch puller right here, which we will need either of those because we're not pulling. We are installing. Dude, this is actually like really heavy. Oh, that looks so, yo, okay. First off, this looks gorgeous. Uh, secondly, this thing is heavy, heavy, like... Thick! All right, there we go. Dude, this thing's sick. Also, too, they do have RGB on the sides, so pretty stoked to see how that actually looks on the desk. You wanna see the knob? It's yellow. All right, wait, let's open this one up. What the heck? Why is it not cutting it? There we go. All right, so this is the yellow knob that we picked. I actually really like the yellow. 
It's like a nice like mustard yellow, in my opinion. Oh! <laughs> there you go, this is the knob. Uh, let me see, do I just... Okay, yeah, I just yank it off. There we go, okay, now it's fully installed. All right, there we go, and the build's over. So next, we need to install the uh, switches. So luckily, these are pre-lubed. So these are the Glorious Links. Like I said, these are a linear switch. These things are amazing. Um, I've used them before because I've put them in a different build. But yeah, I love them. They're great. It reminds me of like, um, what's that dang show? With Jesse and what's his face, where they like they cook. <laughs> yes, Breaking Bad. There we go. Yeah, Breaking Bad. I don't know why I had a brain fart on that one. Pretty dang nice, right? All right, there we go. We just plug away now. All right, now for the next set. Oh yeah, and they have like their glorious link stickers. All right. Then we're gonna plug this in and we're gonna test it just to make sure it works. Sweet, so now that we have all of our switches installed, we're actually gonna go ahead and test them before we cap them off with these beautiful little pieces right here. I wanna find it. Why is this so hard to get in the box? Get in the box, hurry up. All right, now we're done with the switches. We have our knob installed. So next up is going to be the keycaps. So. Again, I went with the uh, Celestial Fire. They have a bunch of different like gradients on their website, which are super cool. I think it's double shot PBT if I'm not mistaken, but I'm pretty excited. Again, like, I don't know, most of my like keyboards, like they have some graphics because I usually get a lot of like certain brand, but I'm really excited for this kind of like gradient with also like those mute colors, but then have those colors splash throughout the keyboard with everything else. So I'm pretty excited. So let's go ahead and install these. Ooh. Look at these colors. Oh, dude, I'm pumped. It's great too, because these colors are kind of mute. So like, they're not gonna be too bright, but they're gonna add a nice splash to it, dude. I'm so stoked for these. I also have no idea where to start, even though they're labeled B1, B2, B3. Dive in and hope to God I don't mess it up. Oh, that's kind of sick, dude. Some of the F buttons are just like black, but then some of them are actually colored. Dude, this is gonna look so good when everything's on it. Is there a guide on this? Doubtful? Oh no, there is actually on the back of it. It shows you. Okay. Sick. I haven't had a keyboard like this in so long, dude. I have no idea what's there. Do I look it up? Let me look it up. Dude, I feel so stupid. I don't know what these, like, what the layout of the keyboard's supposed to be. All right, and there it is. So now we got all of our keycaps on there. They're all proper. I had to look it up a couple times. I'm not gonna lie. Kind of a dummy when it comes to that. Also, we were kind of just chatting. I don't know if it's gonna be a YouTube video or not, but like, let me know in the comments section down below. Did you guys actually have to go and do like a typing class where with the typing class, they would basically have like the covers for the keyboard so you couldn't see them? Like, or am I just dating myself now and showing how old I actually am? So I don't look that old, especially with this beautiful mullet. All right, now we got the blue top frame that goes on this bad boy. Hopefully I just snap it on and don't have to remove everything that I just put on there because I forgot about that. Whoopsies. We had black and green and orange. Oh, that's got some weight to it. Okay. Scro Wait, there's screws? Why are there screws? Yep. I definitely got to unscrew some stuff. That's all right. So I got I to gotta remove the knob and I have to unscrew part of it. So I did mess up on that. Oh, well. Stubborn. Get out. That's sick. Woo, sturdy. Yeah, I thought it was literally just you snap it off, you snap it on and that's it. Sure taught me a lesson. <laughs> All right, let's do the reveal. Ready chat, here we go, here we go. Oh, ooh, that's a really beautiful blue, okay. Out of the package, that looks really nice. Look at that. Look at that dude, that's a nice little top mount right there and they still got the sides. Blutiful, someone ban him. Man said blutiful because that's blutiful. Someone, someone needs to ban him. Please, please ban him. Someone, anyone. Ooh. Dude, that blue is so... 
I didn't think this blue was that good looking, but like seeing it in person, that like almost gunmetal shine is crazy. You know what, actually, I remember there's still one more thing I have to do, the cable. Oh, that red is so sexy though. Oh my God. Dude, that is, that is a beefy, dude. Okay, that thing's beefy. Look at this. Look at that dude, this thing's beefy, dude. That's a chonky cable, man. It's got some weight to it and stuff too. All right, I'm not gonna lie. I don't think I'm actually gonna cable manage it. I think I'm just gonna throw it over. I'm just gonna throw it over, chat. I'm gonna throw it, throw it in a circle. So I'm gonna be honest, lengthwise? Yeah, no, lengthwise, that would not have worked. All right, yeah, so it's a good thing I didn't manage it. I'll have to get an extension cable. All right, and this is kind of cool. If you guys didn't know this, so this actually has like a little connector on it. I don't know who made this popular. I think it's just the keyboard community, but you basically just have this little cable right here and then you kind of connect it, lock it in. It's like a locking little screwing mechanism. Hello, glorious cable. Dude. Yo, that actually looks so sick. Chat, look at that. All right, that's it. Now we can start playing video games. Just kidding. Who wants a sound test? Dude, this thing sounds and looks so good. Oh my God, this is incredible. Dude, I love also too, like the, the colors, like the accents of colors. Even on like this like mute desk, I think it looks sick, dude. What do you guys think? W, W sound, W sound, W sound, W sound, W sound. Yeah, glorious to the W sound. It's definitely got like a nice, like, uh, almost like marbly sound. It's definitely got a clacky sound at the bottom of it, which is nice. It does sound really good. I like that clacky sound. So if you guys like clacky keyboards, I feel like this is definitely a good keyboard. There we go. So that is it. This is the beautiful, glorious keyboard. Um, thank you again so much to Glorious Gaming for sending this out to me. I really appreciate it. Can't wait to try it out. Type on it some more. Has a nice clacky sound to it. Um, obviously, you guys heard doing the sound test, but yeah, I appreciate it. So thank you again, Glorious, for sending me this keyboard. I had so much fun building this in my community. W Glorious, W Community. Thank you guys for sitting here watching me do this. I appreciate y'all. Um, hope you guys had fun. And yeah, this is going to be the end of the uh, YouTube video. Thank you guys so much. If you guys enjoyed the content, make sure you guys like, subscribe. Also, go follow me on uh, Twitch because I'm trying to do some more like live recording of videos and stuff too so uh yeah definitely you guys make sure you go over there and follow and i appreciate it. i'll see you guys in the next one adios